Oh, and then another one. This is so cute. It matches your guys' it style. Does. So we, we need to get yeah. Yeah, we've got an honorary uncle and honorary auntie uh, T-shirt on right now. Isn't like, uh, like yeah, like is. Alex said, stream uh, and check out this interview online. It's been four months. How's it been? What's what's life like? What are the differences? It's been great. I mean, I couldn't be more grateful for lockdown. I had I can imagine most, right. I had the calmest pregnancy. Um, obviously, I wasn't going anywhere, yeah. so I got to just deal with being pregnant all alone. Well, not alone, well, with my husband, mm. and not th- have no pressures of just being out in society and just really just get ready for my child. And I thought that was really cool. And I thought you, I actually thought if there was a time to fall pregnant, yeah, that was it. Lockdown. I missed out on that, so that's, that's not going Funny to happen. Funny enough, <laughs> well, I fell pregnant before lockdown. But, uh, well, look, it was planned then for you. Yeah, it was as it is. I mean, I remember feeling like. Um, a little bit happy about lockdown because mm. then I could stop. Right. Like, and you don't feel like everyone is continuing yeah. and you sort of, because I, I don't want to get left behind. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just like, okay, we all have to stop. This feels like a holiday. Was that sort of the feeling that you got? 100%. I felt like Every amount of FOMO that I think I would have felt, I didn't. Mm. I mean, the alcohol ban got closed immediately, and mm-hmm. I was like, I mean, you I couldn't can't drink, drink anyway. You can't drink. <laughs> we all can't drink. <laughs> and I mean, being a woman in this industry, once you fall pregnant, that becomes a thing in your head. Like, it's oh my gosh, really am I? Hard. And what what was some of the thoughts that you know came through your head? And I think when we make the decision to have a child, it's a difficult one. It's really difficult. I mean, in most cases, I work in a male-dominated space, and the reality is that our contracts don't have things like Mm. paternity Mm. leave. So these are things that, I mean, you don't think of adding a clause into your contract because, I mean, no one really thinks that I'll fall pregnant tomorrow, you know? And so it was things like that that just got me really anxious and I got nervous and I thought, you know, am I still going to be, are people still going to want to see me on air? And the craziest thing is that at work, they embraced it. They were like, please show your bump. They asked me to, you know, wear tighter clothes so that I could showcase my bump. And funny enough, I remember Anela sending a message saying, um, we need to normalize seeing pregnant women working on yeah. on screen. I think there's absolutely been a shift where, you know, where, where, I mean, I know of actors who have been fired yeah. for falling pregnant. It happens. And there's a huge shift within our industry, and I hope in other industries as well, where being pregnant is the blessing that it is. Yeah. Um, you named your baby Netta. Yes. Which means rain. Yes. Tell us. Yeah, so rain is a big deal in my family. Every time we have a traditional ceremony, whether it's a wedding, whether it's a funeral, whether it's a celebration, whatever it is, there's always rain. It could be 34 degrees in Durban Mm. and it will rain for at least five minutes at the very least. Wow. So I just thought, you know, especially our wedding day, it rained and then we had this beautiful rainbow. Yes. Literally, yeah. Literally, as you reach the bottom of the aisle. Yeah. I kid you not. That's incredible. It I'm was, probably it was blessing. something I kid from you not. a fairy tale. Yeah, probably blessings. So I knew that. Thank you. So I knew that I wanted to name him something to do with rain. And funny enough, the word Netta is such a common Zulu word, mm. but I've never heard it as a name. Um, a lot of people are doing sort of Ayana or Liana or things like yeah. that. And I just thought, Netta's pretty cool. That is stunning. Yeah. You also named him Makosini. I did. We'll get into that conversation. Uh, if you would like to ask Minnie any question, send us through uh, via WhatsApp line 0735793445. You can also use the hashtag 947Drive with Sando. Okay. We take the longer way home with Tabudi and Alex Kay because the playlist is just too hot. Turn it on. 947 Drive with Tando. At Checkers, we on free-range chicken. Stay fresh. Try our... ...to-roam whole bird at the low price of $59.99 per kg. Quality guaranteed or your money back. So why pay more for quality free-range chicken when you can get the same for less at Checkers? Better and better. Ball & Properties is taking luxury lifestyle living to the next level by introducing the luxurious signature collection at the Polar Fields in the exclusive Waterfall Precinct. Embrace a bold new look with these two and three bedroom luxury chic apartments. The Polar Fields has an award-winning state-of-the-art lifestyle center which includes a gym, squash courts, cinema room, restaurant, boardroom and more. On show every Wednesday, Saturday and Sunday. For more info, visit ballwind.co.za. Welcome to the era of smart. 
Experience a smartphone like no other. The Huawei P Smart 2021 with a 5,000 milliamp hour battery and a 48 megapixel quad AI camera. Purchase yours now from Vodacom, MTN, Telcom, Salsi, Game, Incredible Connection, High Store, or in Take Lot, or via the Huawei online store and receive a free Bluetooth headset valued at 699 Rand. D's and C's apply. Okay, we're fixing the living room, the bathroom, and the garden needs some love too. Oh no, the kitchen tops. Which kitchen tops though? What's the inspiration? Parisian? Italian? Okay, David. Directing you to Leroy Merlin, four ways. What the, huh? Don't worry, Davy. I've got you, baby. Set your destination to inspiration with the opening of our new four-way store. From DIY to home and decor and more. Opens 26 March. Leroy Merlin Four Ways. Make your home the best place to live. Traffic 947 Drive with Tando. Remember, you can send us a voice of also what's happening on the roads in your area. 073-579-3445. There's been a collision in Limbro Park on the N3 South. It's just after London Road. The right lane is closed in the area. So expect some delays and also a collision in Midran on the N1 North just before New Road causing delays from the Bikloo Interchange. Those are the two major problems at this stage. Please let us know if there's something going on in your area. Here we go. I go back, back. More fuel for your journey home. Back to the hits. Back to the hits you love. On 947. On 947, when I asked her to be on the show, she's like, Oh my gosh, am I still cool enough? I was like, What do you mean? Can you ever not be cool? Let's, like, let's rather, rather ask that. We're I'm hanging out here every Friday. Like, <laughs> yeah, we'll be here. We'll be here. We will be. With lots of gifts. Remember, if you got questions for Mini Tab Mini, uh, send them over to 073 579 3445. Um, so you've had a very interesting year, right? So it's like, a very difficult time that I know we've spoken about, uh, but you lost your brother. Yeah. And it's something that we have in common. Uh, mine came before yours. Yeah. Um, and I remember seeing such strength in you after it happened like really recently. Yeah. What, where did that come from? Um, I just, I felt like I needed to be there for my family. You know, it was, it was such a terrible loss to, our family is incredibly close. It's mm. just the five of us. And he was the most important person to each of us. Why? He was the favorite. Yeah. He was the favorite in terms of my parents' favorite. He was our favorite. He was our baby. Um, you know, so he was he was just the superstar. And, and what we loved about him is that he 
he was one of those people that he didn't really care what people thought. You know, he did what he wanted to mm. do when he wanted to do it. I mean, he said he wanted to be a pilot to three and eventually became a pilot. Wow. Never changed. Um, so he was just incredibly decisive. He knew who he was and he was just such a phenomenal human being. And I knew when I was pregnant and I was really hoping it was a boy. Yeah. Um, and when it was, I knew I had to name him after my brother. How beautiful is That's that? That's amazing. Yeah. What are some of the lessons that you learn when you have a loss that close to you? It just puts life into perspective. You start realizing that um, there's no time to deal with nonsense anymore. Yeah. I, I feel like I used to be one of those people who I cared a lot what people thought, what people thought about me, what my what my perception was, you mm. know, how people perceived me. And after he passed away, I just realized that, you know what, it's my life. And I was born sort of into this world and I will leave alone. And you know, I need to make the most of, of my time here. Mm -hmm. And that comes with really just doing what I love, spending time with the people that I love. And it, it gave me that focus, I guess. And I learned now that you actually don't have a nanny. No. So you and your husband, if you, you're here right now, so your husband's at home with the baby. Yep. And then when he's at work, yeah. You were at home with the baby. He was in Sun City last week. I was home alone with the baby. It was magical. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to say the opposite. <laughs> it was hard. It's hard. Are you guys fighting? Are you guys fighting for the attention of, of an No, no, not even. I mean, oh. at this point, we're just tag teaming. Oh, okay. yeah. Shame, so, but he's he's great. He's it's such a good kid. We're very lucky. Uh, sure. you, you said that women lie about the process of, of pregnancy. Listen, Tando. I <laughs> said to you, I said when you are planning yes. on having a baby, tell you, me. You give me a call. Let's pretend I'm planning. Okay. This but we're going to call this. Did you say mini tips? It's called mini tips. <laughs> yes. Okay, so first of all, no one tells you about breastfeeding. That it's painful? It's excruciating. <laughs> <laughs> well, like biting. Like no, 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 no. They, they don't have teeth. It's they like have a gums. vacuum. But it is. Oh, no. No, no, no. It's excruciating. Really? Like, I sat in a corner and cried. It is. It's, it's excruciatingly painful. Especially for the first two weeks. After two weeks, though, it's great. <laughs> um, as the women say it as is. As the women say it is. Yes. But literally for the first two weeks, I really, it was, it was the most, my birth wasn't even that, what? that painful. And you say your baby was a big baby. My baby was a massive baby. And what else? What else? What else? So, what, so what, why else should I not have a child? <laughs> oh, no, don't not have a child. That's not what I'm saying. But like, there's a lot of things, and then there's a lot of. So everyone talks about the hormones and talks about the cravings. I didn't get cravings. Yeah. So I had no cravings. The only thing though is I cried all, all the, time. the time. Everything made. Me, so sometimes, like my husband says something, I'm like. <laughs> That's really me. <laughs> <laughs> and then the one time he made me chops because I asked for chops. Yeah. And he made me chops and he made the chops medium rare or medium. Yeah. Don't tell me you started crying. And I, I wept. <laughs> no. Because you can't eat anything bloody, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. it has to be well done. So I'm not mad at a well done chop. Uh -huh. but, and I was starving. Yeah. So I get this chop and it's just a bit of blood and I cried. <laughs> I sat on the floor and I cried. <laughs> but poor well, husband. Well, I'm glad we can now give you anything we want because we're going to play Can't Beat with you and okay. we're going to make it a food challenge. Awesome. So we have five different items that uh, you, listening, Joburg, get to guess. And if you do, you could win yourself a thousand rands. It's all courtesy of my way. Okay. We take the longer way home with Tabudi and Alex Kane because the playlist is just too hot. Turn it on. 947 Drive with Tando.
How soon? About a month. Hint that tape. quick? Yeah. Okay, so if people don't know, um, you can catch her on Home Ground. It's every single Monday on... Super Sport 4, Super Sport 4. and Zansi Magic. People were giving you a hard time about being on Super Sport. Not really. I think I got a hard time about being on, on SABC Sport. So it got better when you switched yeah, over? Yeah, because I'd been on SABC Sport for four years. A hard time like how? Like people were going on about, oh, what does she know about sports? Yeah. Oh, but I, I dealt with that a lot when I started. By the time I got to Super Sport, they sort of created a niche for me. So yeah. I kind of, I do specialist events. I do lifestyle sports. So if I'm interviewing an athlete, I'm not asking you about your game. Yeah, I'm yeah, asking yeah. you about your life, yeah. your goals, your ambitions. So, kind of something else that you uh, dived into recently is uh, MD, um, your, your own brand, your baby, which is yeah. available in click stores, am I correct? ShopRite stores. ShopRite stores. Yes. Uh, how did that idea come about? Well, I really wanted to be the face of a beauty brand. And <laughs> I kept knocking on doors and I just, I don't know, it just didn't happen. Yeah. I was either too young, I wasn't popular enough, I wasn't relevant enough. You know, there were just so many yeah. no's that were thrown at me and then... I just realized one day that I'm not going to wait for a corporate to decide. Yes, yeah, cool. That Where's the horn You're good at? enough. Thank you. It's like if they're not going to make your face, I'll be my I'll face. I'll be my own face. face. <laughs> Love to see it. In just a bit, we play Can't Beat uh, Challenge with My Way and with Minnie. Uh, today, we're playing with Andre. Here's Andre. Yes, he's back. Back again. Yes. Andre's back <laughs> for the win. Yesterday was just the beginning, guys. I'm okay. here to win. Can't beat once again. Andre is the reigning champ. He won yesterday. He's uh, trying to claim another thousand bucks today. But I think if Tanika has anything to do with it. Hey, guys. This is Tanika from Newlands, Johannesburg. Shame. I think I'd better take this win from Andre today. <laughs> he doesn't know what's coming. Wow. <laughs> She's already feeling sorry for him. Oh, wow. Well, one of them said a chance to win a thousand uh, rands in cash today. If you want to be like them next week, do the right thing. And Enter now on 947.co.za. The most fuel-efficient way to experience every corner of your city. Are you ready for this? 947 Drive with Tando. Let's go! Weekdays, 3 till 7. Things just got juicier and tastier. Get more for your buck when you buy bulk at Meat World. With A-Class Hindquarter and A-Class Forequarter for just 64 Rand 99. You heard that right, only 64 Rand 99 per kilo. And we'll even cut and package it according to your specifications. So you can choose how you want your favorite cuts. What more could any meat lover want? Visit a Meat World near you and save. Meat World, your friendly family butcher. T's and C's apply. Looking for a quality used vehicle? Check out Auto Pedigree online www.autopedigree.co.za With more than 70 dealerships countrywide and over 40 years of trusted sales and service, buying a used vehicle from Auto Pedigree means buying peace of mind. Visit an Auto Pedigree dealership near you today or visit us online at autopedigree.co.za because you deserve a great deal. T's and C's apply. Beautiful skin starts from within. Introducing Biogen's bespoke range of Nutri Cosmetics that nurture hair, skin, and nail health from within. Biogen's Renew Collagen Plus Skin includes collagen peptides, vitamin C, biotin, and antioxidants to nourish and support your healthy skin. Now, with all the ingredients that you need to make your new look shine, there is no better place to start your glow up. Biogen Renew, available in Biogen and Renew. If you love Joburg, 947 loves you. It's a new look, 947. Daybreak. Daybreak. With Nick Explicit. loves you. Yep, it's official. From the 23rd of March, you'll hear me on 947 Drive.
with Tando. Oh, have you met my co-host? He's gorgeous, he's a pilot, and he's a hit with the ladies. It's Alex Cage. Wow, I'll, uh, I'll take that. Thanks. Yeah, and I took him from Anel in the club. Sorry, club. Anyway, so I was thinking we start the show with like a really dope, like epic song. Chariots of Fire. No. Uh, Ricky Martin, Loving La Vida Loca. Last suggestion. Try, try me one more time. Aqua, I'm a Barbie girl. Are you a Barbie girl? Oh, uh... This is why we're getting you to decide. Make sure to tune in from the 23rd of March. It's Tando on 947, 3 to 7 p.m. on 947. 947.
Mina Mini. She's actually about to play Can't Beat With Us. Oh, I'm, I'm actually very excited because she's about to do something I did earlier in the week. Uh, except she's going to make it look much prettier. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's, it's time for the battle of the day. We're playing Can't Beat With My Way for your chance to win a thousand bucks and come back on Monday and do it all over again. Well, actually, not really because on Monday we start again. Monday's a fresh start. Yeah, yeah. We asked you to enter on 947.co.za and prove that you have what it takes to go head to head and win in Joburg's most fun quiz. And now we're about to find out. We're playing Can't Beat on 947 Drive with Tando for your chance to win 1,000 Rand today and another one tomorrow. All thanks to my way. Live your way. Right, there is an insurer who believes that helping you live your way is what's most important. So they offer you great insurance products and benefits as well as letting you do and letting you do self-inspections on your newly insured car yourself instead of having to go to an inspection center. Do you know who it is? It's my way. Yeah, who else? Well, because when it comes to helping you live your way, you can't beat my way. So visit myway.co.za. Today, my way is a non-life insurer and licensed FSP. T's and C's apply and we are ready. We are playing with Andre, who won yesterday. Andre, how are you doing today? Uh, I could not be better. It's Friday. The you know sun what I mean? Hey. It's payday. Yeah. Yeah, it, is, day. it is actually a good day. It Andre, is a good day. When you put it that way, and with my could, way. And you could be a thousand rand richer today as well. Well, if Tanika says that ain't happening. Tanika, how are you doing? I'm all right, can you? Good, thanks. Are you giving Andre a run for his money? I am, yes. Okay, we're about to find out. So we've blindfolded our guest, Mini. She's wearing um, a blindfold written bombshell. And by the way, we're streaming all of this uh, on our Facebook oh, on our Facebook page, 947. So if you want to go see what she's eating and this bombshell uh, blindfold, go check it out. And then, of course, our resident waitress, Lerato Herba. <laughs> <laughs> At our service. Okay, she's about to feed Mini. You just have to describe. So you can smell. Okay. And then just describe once it's in your mouth. Okay. Right, what, what are you smelling? What are you smelling? Like try. It smells like mints. It smells like mints. Okay. Oh damn! Was I not supposed to say that? No, mints is not mints. Thankfully. Okay. Open my. Oh, maybe don't mess with her. Lerato. She literally <laughs> spills all over her top. Literally. Lerato's not getting a tip. Lerato, you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so describe to it. What is it? <laughs> um. <laughs> Is it, what, how does it taste? Okay, it's burny. Okay, oh, it's, it's hot. It's hot, okay. It's like spicy. Andre right? Tanika, if you know what you want um, or you know the answer, say your name. Think of something that tastes like mint, but it's not mint. What was that? Come on, Andre. guys. Uh, Andre. 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 Curry. It's curry is correct. Yes. One point for Andre. That was really good. Yeah, yeah. It's so all over your top. You'll have some what, later. What curry was that? So it's curry from Aji's German style kitchen. They right here at Monte Casino. Yeah. Come through and check them out. Here comes the second piece of item. Which Whatever it is. Spill. You can smell first. You can't spill this. Don't worry. Yeah. Okay. Um, smells sweet. Okay. Smells sweet. In your hand. Okay. You can put it in your mouth. Mm, I know exactly what this is. Okay, describe it okay. and tell us. It's something that is tangy. Mm. It is a sweet. And it is... Um, what did Simone and Pumba eat? <laughs> Tanika. Andre. Tanika. Uh, no, wait, was Tanika first? Yeah. Tanika. Go for it, Tanika. I'm going to jelly babies. No. Close enough? You're close, but no, we can't accept. Uh Andre Sauerworms. Yes! <laughs> That's two points to Andre. Oh, this. All right, no, wait, give her the other one. Give her this one. Give Give her this one. Okay, I want to give her give her, no, 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 give okay, it to her now. Okay. Give it to her now. Oh, this is going right, to be so good. Andrew, Andrew's got two points. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know exactly. What <laughs> <laughs> of course you do. And I'm going to give this to you to hold in your hand. Yeah, I'm sure she knows how to put that in the mouth. All right, so describe it to us. What are you holding I'm in your hand? Must I have it first? <laughs> yes, you must have it so you can describe what it tastes like. I'm mean, going to have no idea what this is. <laughs> how would you describe the smell, though, by the way, before you tell us how Ooh. it tastes? Ooh. Are you feeling it's better? It's an alcoholic beverage. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is my favorite alcoholic <laughs> beverage. Andre. Okay, you wouldn't Andre. know what that is. Um, Andre. I'm gonna, I would. Uh, Andre. I'm tequila. Tequila! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Andre's the winner. Andre, you won this one. Three points to Andre. Sorry, Tanika, you gave it a shot. Can I take this off now? Yes, you can take it off now. Are you, how are you feeling? Are you right today? Hey? Are you feeling fine? Oh, these are my feet. Oh, good. <laughs> okay, good. Andre, you walk away with a thousand bucks. It's all courtesy of my way. Tanika, unfortunately, oh, oh you walk God. away with nothing. But thank you so much uh, for playing. Remember, if you want your chance to play Can't Beat and win, enter now at 947.co.za and tune in again next week. When you love the music, you love the ride. All the hits. 947 Drive with Tando.
So they're going to prepare our sushi for us. Alex wants to light the sushi, and I said no. I, listen, no. Mini, let you, can, can Mini decide? Because I, I'm, 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 I like to think I'm qualified for this. Wow. Putting don't. me on the spot. No, no don't. Yeah. And, 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 and Anella was in... just telling us yesterday not to trust him because with he's going to make it with anything. Yeah, no, yeah I want to see. I like to see. see. Oh, gosh. Yeah, it's all right. It's okay. Well, uh, <laughs> 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 I, I, listen, I can handle it. I'm I just really not. I'm so my decision and we had their lives documented like you did right you had your whole wedding um basically on all of the country's television screens right it was amazing it was such a fun experience it was actually less stressful than planning the actual wedding wait what do you mean P putting it on tv was less stressful yeah, than producing the show was less stressful than planning my wedding wow yeah it was so much fun because i mean creatively i got to play around with yeah. the type of content that i wanted to put on i got to really flex my producing chops it was the it was my first production was and, my and first nice. show. that's beautiful that it was something so close to your heart and so yeah, personal exactly. but now you're fully producing you have a film that you're producing yeah. how amazing oh, that's, that's awesome. yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah she's a film producer put some respect on her name yeah, thank absolutely. you tell us about it producing a film it should be coming out in the next couple of months what yeah what are you what's it about um i can only tell you the title am i allowed to tell you the title i don't know if i've got you're it you're the straight. producer babe. okay it's called goodbye goko goodbye goko yeah. and yeah. were you one of the writers how's this working yeah so um i come up with the concepts i come up with the story and then i work with um some writers and then they develop it into a script and when did you do all of this lockdown wow. <laughs> so it, all, it all actually worked out for you yeah like so we haven't on. started filming yet we're just busy in the scripting phase at the okay. moment but it's it's quite sh like the turnaround time is going to be quite quick so we're quite excited about it so you should see it in the second half of the year so probably july august time is when we're hoping for it to tx and what i'm oh, excited did you hear the producer talk that came through there to go on air, babes. To go on air, <laughs> on, Alex. Come on, get with the time. I'm really excited. I'm I'm gonna be in in my film. Nice, of course. Um, yeah, just to give it a little bit of weight and it's as well. Not in the call yet. Oh, okay. I hope the boss of nine four seven heard. It's just a day. I promise. <laughs> She'll be back by three. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Minnie, we've watched you literally on our TV screens from when we were this high. We've seen you grow. Well, not this high because, I mean, I was the same age as you. <laughs> but, but we've literally seen you grow into a woman and now into a mother, now into a producer. We are so proud of you. Thank, thank, you. thank you for sharing this first with us as we celebrate yeah, thank you. Um, our first. And you came on the right day. Right. There's champagne. There's food. <laughs> like Speaking of which, though, yes. I want to say congratulations. Aww. I'm so excited. When I heard that you were on the show, I mean, I reached out immediately. Yeah. I was so excited and I bought you probably like the biggest bouquet of flowers Aww. that you can see so that's for you Aww. I just wanted to say congratulations oh, and you. I will be tuning in every weekday from 3 to 7 p.m. 7 p.m. and 947 loves you Aww. I love you guys too <laughs> you lose yourself in and people you find yourself in 947 drive with Tundor we used to be giants when did we stop? You've made it to the weekend. Now, your weekend is about to get made. Cooley Sunny on 947 Weekend Breakfast. The 947 Top 40 with Swelly. Tully B Weekends on 947. 947, new and exclusive with Ianda MVP. You know I cut this right. Chris Beats is on the 947 Block Party. Nick Explicit. On 947. 947. Pull up for the weekend.